Hey guys, Kitty Cats Gang. Well, Kitty Cat Morgan back with another video. And today I'm going to be showing you how to get a new moving background on Flipper Clip. So, what you want to do first. Oh gosh, no, I don't want to do that. So, what I want to do first is I want to add a new frame and I just want to go as much as I can. I don't know if it'll go all the way through, but I think I need 16 frames. But I'm just going to go 20 just in case it does go through. So, what you want to do is you want to go to add video. It'll come over all your video. So I've got this one. So it's reading the file and okay, let's just import it. And sometimes it takes a while to import. So I'll be back with you guys when I'm there. So mine's got this weird black thing, but I don't care. So if you do that, look. It's still the same and it does go for all of the things i don't know why these two are here so if you add like quite a few frames or adds all of these frames but i need to like crop mine better so that it all fits in and then you can just do your animation which i'm just gonna which look but mine is on 12 frames, so I wonder what happens if I go to 7 frames per second. It's still the same but slower. I like to go on 2 per second, but let me see what 5 per second is. Yeah, I like that. It's not too fast, not too slow. So they still go quite quickly, but yeah, that's the easiest way to do it without using the green screen. Because look, it still moves. So you just got to get any recording system. I use D Screen Recorder. And record the video, then crop it in the edit. So that you can't see what you record it with. And then, yeah, it will move. So it's pretty cool. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this on how to get a moving background. And yeah, see you in the next video.